Rachel Levine, the Assistant Secretary of Health, has been named a four-star admiral and is being hailed as the first female four-star admiral to not be female or an admiral. The move came only moments before I was named the first two-legged horse with glasses to win the Kentucky Derby after I ran around my room in a circle shouting, look at me, I'm a horse, and I've won the Kentucky Derby. Now, I know what you're thinking. You're thinking, oh, Clavin, you are so funnelicious that if I licked your face, it would taste like laughter. And yes, that's true, but I'm not making this up. I really did win the Kentucky Derby in the same sense that Rachel Levine really is a woman and became an admiral. President and venal houseplant Joe Biden followed the Levine appointment by issuing an executive order declaring federal employees are not allowed to laugh if they see a man walking around wearing a dress, a string of pearls, and one of those bicorn hats Horatio Nelson used to wear because he was an admiral who defeated the French Navy at sea where admirals are. The mandate against laughter forbid not only open guffawing, but also giggling silently into your hand or trying very hard not to laugh, but unintentionally making a snorting noise that sends a gout of Mountain Dew up into your nose so that you feel like you're drowning in an ocean of pitiable delusions and governmental incompetence. China celebrated the Levine appointment by sending a hypersonic missile around the world in low orbit and using it to drop a note off on the Resolute desk in the Oval Office. The note read, Congratulations, America, on appointing a man in a dress who has never served in the Navy as an admiral. And by the way, this note could have been a nuclear weapon. The CIA director, William Burns, reacted to the note from China by saying, quote, Wow, cool missile. We didn't even know China could make one of those because we were too busy leaking information to The New York Times about American politicians we don't like and totally missed the fact that China now has a nuclear missile that can fly into our airspace completely undetected. It sure was nice of them to send that note, though, unquote. Mr. Burns then appointed his daughter's pet bunny, Flower, as a double O agent with a license to kill, hailing the rabbit as the first double O agent with long ears and fur. Other recent administration appointments <laughs> include the blonde girl from Game of Thrones as the official mother of dragons, and of course, Joe Biden as president of the United States. If you want more terrific content like this, like us and subscribe. <laughs>